What's going on YouTube? Giosno right here. So in today's video, we have some important things to discuss, especially for those of you who want to chill break iOS 17. The brand new iOS version, iOS 17.6 beta 1 is now out, which backports some very big security mechanism from iOS 18. So do not update. We're going to get into that in a second. This video is brought to you by Tenorshare Rayboot, a software that can fix your iOS system if it's broken, stuck in Apple logo, in a boot loop and stuff like that. Definitely check the program out in the link below. A free trial is available for both Windows and Mac OS and iOS 18 beta is supported. So for those of you who want to jailbreak with Pelerin or any other jailbreaks in the future, it really applies to a lot of stuff, you should know that iOS 17.6 beta 1 has backported a couple of changes from iOS 18. The Pelerin team just posted this and they said that this prevents non-root processes from spawning binaries. Now we've known about this for a while because once iOS 18 beta 1 was released, Alfie posted this, quote, iOS 18 seems to have introduced a new security feature, meaning that arbitrarily entitled binaries not running as root can no longer spawn binaries as root. This means that in the event of another core trust bug, it is unlikely that Trollstore would be able to support iOS 18. Well, this does apply for Trollstore, which does require a root helper, but it's not the only thing that gets broken. Apparently, Pelrin gets broken too, and it is broken on iOS 17.6 beta 1 because Apple backported that change from iOS 18 beta, breaking Pelrain and Troll Store and any application that requires a root helper, for example, Troll Files or stuff like that, in the process. So if you want to jailbreak right now, even if you have a Pelrain compatible device, I would advise you to stay on iOS 17.5.1 or lower. Even if you don't have a Pelrain compatible device and you are on an 8.12 or newer device, this still applies to you because we don't know for sure how far the extent of the damage goes at this moment. And we don't know what options we have for now. Pelerin itself requires a lot of root processes in order to, you know, bootstrap and do the jailbreak procedure. But it's not the only jailbreak that requires that kind of stuff. A lot of jailbreaks work the same way. So anything would basically be broken at this point on iOS 18 beta, but now also on 17.6 beta 1. So it's a good idea to stay on iOS 17.5.1 or lower. For Pelerin, there could be an update. They are working on something. There's no ATA available. They said, for now we will attempt to fix it on our end however there is no guarantees on this happening immediately as we've been very busy so the team behind Pelrain can do something about this for Pelrain, but it will take some time so do avoid that beta stick with 17.5.1 for now thank you for watching i'm geosnow till the next time peace out